Hello everyone, Stig Doug back with another video. And uh, I'm cur curious what this guy over here does exactly. Oh! Oh, that's what he does. Thanks for stepping on my face. Here's the three gold. Really? So, it's a free service, I guess. I wasn't really paying attention to how much gold I had. Sans, you again. You're pretty much everywhere. I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. It's normally 50000 to use this premium telescope. But, since I know you, you can use it for free. How's about it? This telescope doesn't do anything, Sans. Sans, are you playing a trick on me? Huh? You aren't satisfied? Don't worry. I'll give you a full refund. What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? Oh, I don't want to answer that. Funny man. I relocated my store, but there are still no customers. Fortunately, I have thought of a solution. Punch cards. Every time you buy an ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can trade them for a free ice cream. They're sure to get the customers to come back. An ice cream is the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now, 25. Well then, tell your friends there's ice cream hidden in the depths of a watery cavern. The ancient glyphs have been painted over with a list of 21 different flavors. Uh huh. We'll turn your lights out. Eventually those mushrooms are going to do something. Punch cards. Ice cream. I don't know which way I want to go first. You hear a passing conversation. So, don't you have any wishes to make? Really, actually, I think I'm going to go back this way. That seems like the appropriate way to go. <coughs> but I don't want to go there just yet. Hey, it's a duck. Do, do, do. You got any grapes? I can't reach the duck. So, you don't have any wishes to make? Hmm, just one, but it's kind of stupid. What's this? Mold small. Uh, I think they're worth one gold. If you lay down on the ground with them. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? You got the ballet shoes. It's a weapon? I'll take it. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know, her opinion of you was very... murdery. But I bet you knew that already. And because you knew that, I told her what you were... I told her what you told me you were wearing. A dusty tutu. Because I knew, of course, after such a suspicious question, you would obviously change your clothes. You are such a smart cookie. 
This way you're safe. And I didn't lie. No betrayal anywhere. Being friends with everyone is easy. Good. Washua. Let's get clean. Green means clean. Oh, I got it. I got another one. Oh, that was easy. Don't say that. Come on. I promise I won't laugh. Waterfall. It's always secrets behind waterfalls. But not this one. Oh no, it's two of them. Out, darn spot. No need for a swimming suit. Okay. 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 Oh, they leave behind sparkles. <coughs> Excuse me. It's sweating bullets, literally. Whistle as it cleans. No need for a swimming suit. I want to run away. And I did. The power to take their souls. This is the power that humans feared. Okay. <laughs> Wait, I never found the duck. And I'm not going to. Probably won't find it this route. This route. I'm frozen. <laughs> hey there. Noticed you were here. I'm Onion San. Onion San, you hear? You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You love it, huh? Yeah, me too. It's my big favorite. Even though the water's getting so shallow here. I have to sit down all the time, but... And hey, that's okay. It beats moving to the city and living in a crowded aquarium. Like all my friends did. Look at that face. And the aquarium's full anyway, so even if I wanted to, I... That's okay, though. You hear? Undyne's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? Hey, there. That's the end of the room. See you around. Have a good time. In waterfall. Poor onion. It's very anime. He has a lot of anime expressions. Shiren hides in the corner, but somehow encounters you anyway. Check. Tone deaf. She's too ashamed to sing her deadly song. Aww. Toot. Aww. I'm gonna hum with you. You hum a funky tune. Shiren follows your melody. Siree, siree, siree. Oh. Seems much more comfortable singing along. Hum. You hum some more. Monsters are drawn to the music. Suddenly it's a concert. Si fa si fa so fa so mi ra ri. Sans is selling tickets made of toilet paper? Where does Sans come from? Sans isn't even here. I know I can spare her, but I want to keep coming. Because I'm selling out tickets. The seats are sold out. You feel like a rock star. Me so, me so, me see me. The crowd tosses clothing. It's a storm of socks. Oh my god. The tourists, the groupies, it's all aggressive tuning. Aaron thinks about her future. 
You and Siren have come so far, but it's time. You both have your own journeys to embark on. You hum a farewell song. Uh. <laughs> Ouch! No! Oh, she leaves. You don't have to spare her. Northern room has a great, uh, great treasure. No, it doesn't. You're lying. Okay, I don't have any idea what to do there. A haunting song echoes down the corridor. Won't you play along? Only the first eight are fine. Wait a second now. This power has no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. And an incredible power will be needed to take the soul of a living monster. I have no idea what to do here. I'll probably have to get that another time. I really don't feel like looking up a guy to cheat my way through that. There's only one exception. The soul of a special species of monster called a boss monster. A boss monster soul is strong enough to persist after death, if only for a few moments. A human would absorb this power, or this soul, but this has never happened. And now it never will. Aww. Okay. It's a statue. The structures at its feet seem dry. This thing is going to come to life and kill me. Please take one. Of what? Look at that. Is there any reason for me to have this? I'm wondering if that music is what I need to play. Yeah, it sounded similar, but I don't think I can copy it. That's adorable. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> That's weird. Oh, 
Yo, you got an umbrella? Awesome. Let's go. Hmm. Man, Undyne is so cool. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night. Knowing she was going to beat me up. Ha ha ha. So one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of a flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. We ended up coming to school and teaching up in the class about responsibility and stuff. Or he did. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undyne came to school? She could beat up all the teachers. This guy. <laughs> um, maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. Yo, this ledge is way too steep. Yo, you want to see Undyne, right? Put up your umbrella and climb on my shoulders. Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way to get through. And fall on his face. <laughs> I have to make a GIF of that guy. The humans, afraid of a power, declared war on us. They attacked us suddenly and without mercy. The serene sound of a distant music box, it fills you with determination. In the end, it could hardly be called a war. United, the humans were too powerful and us monsters too weak. Not a single soul was taken and the countless monsters turned to dust. This again, this eerie shadow face. And that's why. Okay. You again. Okay, I see the game. Oh, you're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. Her armor is so cool. I want it. Like, this is so confusing. She's getting faster all the time. I want to see what's back this way. Nothing. Don't you ever get tired. Is this a dead end? So it is. Am I falling now? <laughs> My character does not have any like expression. It just falls. Yeah. 
It sounds like it came from over here. Oh, you've fallen down, haven't you? Are you okay? Here, get up. Big dog, huh? That's a nice name. My name is... Okay. That was some Final Fantasy VII stuff if I've ever seen it. Piles of garbage. There's quite a few brands you recognize. I think this might be the good, a good time to roll into the next video. So, okay, bye. Holy Moses.